Tonight, a fashion icon who designed a beloved bag for a generation is gone. I have 10 Kate Spade bags. This morning, the body of the 55-year-old designer was discovered by her housekeeper in her Manhattan home. It appears at this point in time to be a, a tragic case of apparent suicide, but it is early in the investigation. There was a, a suicide note left at the scene. When Kate Spade got into the handbag business, her goal, she said, was to design something simple, something classic. Now, one of the most recognizable brands in fashion. Celebrities and fans posted tributes online, many just a photo of a bag with the story behind it. Others stopping for a moment to shine a light on mental illness. It really goes to show success and fame and money do not make you happy. Born Kate Brosnahan, she grew up in Kansas City, eventually meeting and marrying Andy Spade, brother of actor David. They launched the company together in 1993 out of their cramped New York City loft. She was also this role model for other young women who wanted to start their own businesses. In 2006, Spade sold the business to spend more time with her newborn daughter. It was a great time for us to take a break, and it was much needed, and it was a great luxury. In 2016, the couple announced a new line and a new name, Frances Valentine. I think sometimes designers make the mistake when they're starting a business to look at the success of someone else's and say, oh, that looks good, maybe I should... Well, no, 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 that's already there. They don't need another one. So, you know... Start your own and, and build your own sensibility. Lester, tonight, Anna Wintour, the editor-in-chief of Vogue, had this to say about Kate Spade. She had an enviable gift for understanding what women the world over wanted to carry, adding, Spade built a global empire that reflected who she was and how she lived. Long before we talked about authenticity, she defined it. Some powerful words uh, there. Stephanie, thank you very much. And according to the CDC... Suicide is the 10th leading cause of death in America. If you or someone you know is struggling with suicidal thoughts, the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline is available 24 hours a day, seven days a week. The number is 1-800-273-8255. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.